Hi, today we're going to talk about integration of uh, e-commerce within DNN or Evoke. Uh, uh, now, you know, of course, DNN is a huge uh, content management system with lots of functionality, but it, it lacks uh, e-commerce. Uh, whereas we have uh, large e-commerce vendors, uh, all they do every day is e-commerce. They don't necessarily have um, any content management capabilities. They do have theming and whatnot, but it's not as robust as a content management system. Uh, we have customers or prospects coming to us and, and they're saying is we need both. Yes, e-commerce is great, that drives our business, but we also want to drive some content out because, because that generates you know, what we call as content marketing, right? The content eventually drives growth and, uh, and revenue and they have to go uh, both hand in hand and that's why we're pursuing this uh, uh, kind of have best of both the world um, experience for our customers. Let uh, let you manage your e-commerce via the e-commerce vendor of your choice. Uh, but uh, leverage what the content management has to offer. Now, what I am going to demo today here is, or talk about is the uh, two prominent vendors in the e-commerce space. Uh, one is BigCommerce, the other one is Shopify. And what I'm gonna do is I quickly show you a little bit about their admin interface and, uh, and then also their storefront. And, and that way you'll get to understand what they lack in terms of CMS. Um, and then I'll show you how and what we have done in terms of integration. So let's get going and have a quick look into uh, the admin section of Shopify. Uh, as you can see here on the left hand side, is they're all about kind of orders, uh, products, uh, customers, analytics. Uh, you know, none of this is DNN, right? DNN is all about content, users, files, uh, and whatnot. I mean, you know, they've got things like taxes, payment providers, that's e-commerce speciality. So I have set up two stores on the Shopify side. I have four products. These are fruits. Uh, on the e-commerce side, I am using the default uh, site and they come with a bunch of categories and products. On the DNN side, I have set up two pages, one for Shopify, the other one for Big Commerce, with their respective modules deployed there. All I need to do is now go into their admin area in Shopify or Big Commerce, grab the keys, plug in into DNN, and off we go. Now the products are showing up. On the DNN side, as you can see, there's an add to cart button. When you click that, it opens up the shopping cart on the right hand side. That's all built in and uh, you can increment the amount and whatnot. And uh, once you click on the checkout, we are going to take you to Shopify to complete the transaction. Now we're going to go into the admin panel of BigCommerce, go into advanced settings. Uh, create account and uh, just go ahead and select all the options and it's it is going to generate four keys uh, get all of those and go into DNN and simply plug those in we're showing now in DNN the categories that you would see in the admin area of big commerce the product and product categories or the one you would see in the storefront you're able to see the exact same list uh, now clicking on any of these category will actually take you to the details where you would see the list of all the products and here again similar to Shopify you're able to click on an item and buy. I'm now going to go quickly into the edit mode to show that you can place all of your favorite modules right besides the e-commerce component. It is true for both Shopify as well as big commerce. With that, hopefully you like our vision on e-commerce and how we are proceeding. Looking forward to your feedback and thanks for your time.